Hello everyone, Ben here, and welcome to, uh, this isn't a Trump versus anyone, this is a, uh, ignore the ad, um, this is a Republican primary map, um, and honestly, <clears throat> I know I said I was going to do this, I'm still, deb and I, I finally decided I was going to do this, but there's not really that much of a reason. Uh, just pretend that the blue states, the states I highlight as blue, are going to be uh, for Kasich, who I think is the only Republican who might challenge Donald Trump um, in the primaries. And Trump will probably win Iowa, and I'm just going to do two colors I'm not going to bother with. Um, <clears throat> more than that, because I don't think it's really necessary. Uh, the only poll I've seen for primary shows Trump up like 8% over his primary, uh, 2016 primary numbers in New Hampshire. Now that's unopposed if I remember correctly, <clears throat> but it shows he'll probably gain support in 2016 in the primaries. Um, <clears throat> Um, so Iowa, New Hampshire, I believe South Carolina is next, and Trump will win that. Um, I'm just going to highlight this as Trump, and wish I could add in my own, like a write in your own name tab. Um, what's the next primary? I'm trying to remember. Yeah, California is actually moving its primary up, so Trump will easily win that one, uh, because he, even if he did have competition in 2016, he was easily winning California's primary, uh, because he's the California Republicans like him. <clears throat> and this is the thing, <clears throat> primaries tend to go towards either the more extreme candidate or the candidate the establishment chooses. Um, and Ted Cruz might, but I don't think he will. Like I said, Kasich is the only one. Uh, since I can't remember the primary order that well, and there are a ton of super, uh, you know, super Tuesday states, uh, I'm going to give Trump the overwhelming majority of these states, okay? Especially in the South. Um, sorry about that. I mean, he crushed Marco Rubio in Rubio's home state. Um, Trump will easily win most delegates. versus whoever he's running against. Okay, I mean, it's not even going to be close. Kasich, if he even lasts to Ohio, he'll win Ohio's, you know, delegates, but that's about it. Um... But yeah, Trump will easily win the Republican primary. I'm not even sure why I'm doing this. Um, and there's a lot of reasons. Incumbent presidents tend not to get primary challengers. Uh, Gerald Ford was one example. I think maybe H.W. Bush got a challenge. Uh Reagan, I believe, did get a challenge, but that was kind of the exception to the rule. But other than that, I don't, I don't think many, I don't remember many cases, especially in the modern era, where an incumbent president has been has had a primary challenger, or at least a serious primary challenger. So honestly i just don't really see much of a reason for doing this just highlighting that this is the reason why all my predictions are going to be for trump because i don't see impeachment or removal from office as likely and i also and that means i don't really want to do any speculation of what happens if worse comes to worst and he kicks a bucket in the oval office 
Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you have a nice day. I'll see you next time. Bye.